Mon nom est Yannick Papadopoulos et c'est avec grand plaisir que je vous adresse aujourd'hui. My name is Yannick Papadopoulos and I'd like to thank you all for being here to share this step with us. Memories are priceless. This saying is one of the things I and many sure others live by, and it is true. I could look around all of my to my fellow classmates and ask them, what was your favorite moment of grade six? Someone would say, our grade six Petit Bonheur field trip. Another would say, Quebec City. And another might say, our most recent trip to Arundel. Some might even say, it was when they met their new best friend. When I think back, many moments come into mind. But what I can say my favorite moment was, well, there wasn't just one. Kindergarten to grade six just flashes before me, and many memories of learning how to read, write, public speak, being with friends, and just plain growing up come to mind. I remember being in the classes of some wonderful teachers that helped us throughout the years. Of course, it wasn't an easy ride. You can sense the pressure starting to build up on us about high school. All the preparation, the forms, the teachers always telling us we're just preparing you for high school. C'est difficile de réviser l'année. Je ne peux pas dire que ce n'est pas la plus mémorable. Ce n'est pas à moi la dire. Plusieurs moments se tiennent le coup dans nos esprits. Chacun a de valeur. Notre voyage à Petit Bonheur était l'événement que plusieurs d'entre nous avaient hâte depuis le début du cycle 3. C'était encore mieux ce que j'attendais, non seulement en raison des activités, mais à cause de la chance que nous avons eu à mieux se connaître, les étudiants et les enseignants. Ici, devant nous, il est difficile de croire qu'après aujourd'hui, notre éducation nous conduira sur des chemins différents, à de nombreuses écoles différentes, et que nous allons tous avancer différemment. J'espère que vous vous souviendrez toujours de la classe de finissant 2011-2012 de l'Académie Hillcrest de Bercanshouville. We are now moving on to another path of our life. We are preparing to take a decision on what road to take. It seems so rushed, doesn't it? I mean, it feels like we have to pick our futures now. Even though our teachers tell us it's only a time to think of what we want to be, you still can't help but feel the excitement. But the teachers are actually right. Sure, we don't have to choose our jobs now. What chance would we have to explore them in high school? But it's nice to think about what you might want to do when you grow up. We should find out what our interests are so that we can explore all the possibilities. High school will introduce us to these possibilities. I'm sure what we're all thinking now is two months of summer with no school. But I bet that a lot of you, including me, are looking forward to the great joy and challenge that is just around the corner. They say high school is supposed to be the best time of your life, and I'm ready to experience that. Of course, things can only get harder from here. But if we hold on to our drive to make it in life, we can get anywhere. And then, at the end of grade 11, we'll be saying, now there's college to go through. It'll, ne it'll never stop, but that doesn't mean it can't be enjoyed. I will miss this school a lot. I've had some of the best teachers throughout the years I've been here, kind principal and vice principals, and I'm sure they wish us the best for our journey through high school. For tonight though, let's all enjoy a memorable evening and I hope to, to see you all again when we pick up our grad books in the fall. Merci, thank you. Please come back on stage. So Yanni and Alicia, please come back. We have a little something for you. <laughs> <laughs> 